Hey guys, it's Chris, and in today's video, I'm reviewing Space Jam, A New Legacy. Let's get into it. LeBron James and his son, Dom, get trapped in Warner Brothers' serververse by a rogue AI. So LeBron James must team up with Bugs Bunny and the rest of the Looney Tunes gang in a high-stakes game of basketball against the Goon Squad. Next, I want to talk about some of my favorite moments and references. There's a lot of Warner Brothers references in this movie. Game of Thrones, see the Iron Throne, there's dragons, Harry Potter, you see the broomsticks and they're using magic, the Matrix, they're slowing down time, King Kong, the Iron Giant, Mad Max, there was tons, tons of references. The Goon Squad's intro. So once you actually get to meet the Goon Squad, their intro is uh, pretty stylish and pretty flashy. It's, uh, Pretty cool intro. See, there's a Rick and Morty reference, and it's actually pretty awesome. I'm a big fan of Rick and Morty, so I was happy to see it in the movie. So you see the original monsters from Space Jam and A New Legacy. Overall, Space Jam A New Legacy feels like a modern take on the original more than a sequel. LeBron steals the show. The Looney Tunes may get sidelined compared to the many references to other Warner Bros. properties, but they are the heart of the film. If I had to give this a score of 1 out of 10, I'd give it an 8. Space Jam is a 90s classic and it is still king. Hope you enjoyed this video and as always, don't forget that like and subscribe button. Peace.